Spain's Ministry of Defense has authorized the use of large caliber weapons up to 12.7 millimeters on board tuna vessels fishing in the Indian Ocean to combat pirates. The measure was announced by Defense Minister Carme Chacon after a meeting with representatives of tuna vessels and ship owners of the Spanish fleet in the Indian Ocean. So far, boats have been able to carry weapons of 7.6 mm. Spain is the first country to grant permission to carry heavy weapons on board to fight Somali pirates. The Australian Fisheries Management Authority, also known as AFMA, have announced that from now on the 1st, it will be taking a zero-tolerance approach to Commonwealth endorsed commercial fishing vessels operators who fail to have properly maintained vessel monitoring system, also known as VMS, unit operating at all times. Known as Operation VMS Crackdown, the zero-tolerance campaign will mean that any boat with a VMS unit that stops reporting would be ordered to stop fishing immediately and return to their home port. The European Commission has presented its first proposal on fishing allowances for 2012 for certain fish stocks in the Atlantic Ocean and the North Sea. In total, Brussels calls for cutting caches on 53 stocks for increasing stocks of nine species as in cod, anglefish, herring, haddock, hake, sole, Norway lobster and megrim based on recommendations from the International Council for the Exploration of the Sea, also known as ICES. The Scientific, Technical and Economic Committee for Fisheries, also known as STECF, had interest parties. The EC aims to reach an agreement with the authorities of the 27 EU member states in November to contribute to the recovery of the stocks and sustainability of fisheries in the long term. That's all from here. Thank you for watching Waves.